What time is it? It's science time! It's important, we need to talk about these magnets. I have four different magnets sitting right here in front of me. I have a horseshoe magnet, a circle magnet, a bar magnet, and also a neodymium magnet, which is super strong. Let's see how their strengths compare. Horseshoe magnet. Not too bad. Circle magnet. That picks up a few more. A bar magnet. Not bad. And our neodymium magnet. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> As you can see, the neodymium magnet is super strong. I think that's probably gonna be more than I need for my magnetic racer. But it's good to know it's that powerful. In fact, I think I'm going to use this circle magnet to be the engine to my car only because it's stronger than the other two, the horseshoe and the bar magnet, but it's not crazy strong like that one. I think this is gonna work really well. So now that we know what magnet we're gonna use, let's talk about how these magnets are actually going to move the car down the road. Every magnet has two poles, a north pole and a south pole. When you take two magnets and bring together two opposite poles, those magnets are going to be attracted to one another. However, when you take two like poles and bring them together, those magnets are going to repel one another. We may not be able to see this force, but we can certainly feel the magnetic fields pushing against one another. Thanks for being part of our crew today and checking out this short clip from DIY Science Time. If you like this clip and you want to see more exciting science, check out the full versions right here on the channel. Be sure to subscribe and stay tuned for more exciting DIY Science Time.